Six foot five, nearly 300 pounds of pure malice. The following champion versus champion contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing Imperium from Vienna, Austria, weighing in at 297 pounds, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, Gunter! The ring general has declared the mat sacred and sees this industry as pure sport, meaning there is no room for games and antics. Uh, Gunther takes everything so seriously, like he's always scowling. Hey, listen, he takes pride in what he does. It's difficult not to admire the expertise possessed by Gunther. Gunther is so unflinching, as if nothing phases him. The man's impervious to distraction because he's constantly focused on the task at hand. Yeah, it's like watching a machine. Guess what, folks? It's time to acknowledge the Tribal Chief. And his opponent, representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns! This is the man who WWE and Universal Championships to become undisputed WWE Universal Champion. It was a history-making WrestleMania moment, and this man has had many of those. Uh, here's a question. What has Roman Reigns done that isn't history-making? I actually agree with you, Saxton, a man who has had an indescribable impact on this industry. He's carved his legacy in stone. No one stands in the way of the head of the table for too long. No disqualification, no count outs. We're guaranteed to see a train load of courage before this one is through. Now, this is the type of match where grudges get even uglier. You never know who or what will come out of the woodwork in a battle like this. Well, that's when some outside interference becomes a factor, Corey. We all know that WWE superstars never forget a grudge. Yeah. Getting set up for something in the corner. Gets him with the counter. match interference has to be a concern for these superstars while it certainly can be a factor i don't think it should be a concern the only thing you should be concerned about is getting the win oh forward to the back he's taking this to the floor now to the 
the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Chief locked and loaded. Looking for the victory. Two. No, he gets the shoulder up. A long two and a half in the waning moments of this match. Reigns is trying to pick his opponent apart physically and mentally. And he's able to reverse. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Critical time in this matchup. This is a time to dig deep. Just from a deadlift position. Sad power bomb. He has to be at his limit now. Might want to walk it off or shake it off or do whatever he needs to do to get his head in the game here. From the middle rope. He's able to fend off the attack. And he's taking this to the outside now. He 
He's in serious trouble here and finds his way out. Counter on Guther pays off. A stalemate of counters. Uses an elbow to disrupt that attack. And down with the suplex. The better part of Balor. He leaves the ring, but he could lose this match by count out. Oh, look at this. The power. And Guther with a critically timed maneuver. Guther knows exactly what's at stake at this moment. And returning to the ring. Hooked up. Top and fancy there, spinning your Anagi. Is it enough? The cover! The shoulder out at the last moment. Holy moly, how? Lighten up the chest. Go oh, right to the kidneys. Oh, and countouts are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. to get back inside. Big risk here. He may be counted out. He might be oblivious to the count. Oh, Roman Reigns locked and loaded, measuring his opponent. Here we go. A spear by Reigns. Is it enough to overcome Gunther? Cover. Two. Roman Reigns picks up a strong victory. We've got some time to take another look at some of the highlights from that one. Here is your winner, Roman Reigns! This kind of win establishes him to the world. An important win for him in this one. The Roman Empire grows as Reigns continues to conquer his opposition.